Okay, now you've, you've installed Android Studio. We still have to do a little bit more setup. We have to add the SDK packages, the software development kit packages. So Android doesn't include everything we need automatically to start developing. So we need to go to the SDK and get tools and platforms so that uh, we can develop our apps. And we're going to do that using the Android SDK Manager. And we'll do this by going into Android Studio and updating our files in the SDK Manager there. So when you start Android Studio, you'll get this welcome screen. And let's go by starting a new Android Studio project. And we'll create an application name and let's just call it my first application. Now a company domain, we need to have something in here. It's usually like your name.something.com. It's like a web domain name. And you can see that it creates a package name based on the company domain name, but it's in reverse. So for this, I'm just going to change this up just a little bit and say this is for dccc.edu and the location you can see is going into a particular folder that's been predefined on your computer so if you ever need to know where they're located you can follow this path or you can change it to a different location if you need to I'm just going to keep the default in here and click next We'll leave it as phone and tablet, ice cream sandwich, API 15, and next. We'll just choose a blank activity, and we'll investigate some of these other things as we go on through the course. So I'm going to click next. And again, for these, these will be the names of some of our files and the name of our screen that we start out with. So we're going to keep it as the default right now called main activity and just click finish. So it'll take a minute to go through and build everything. All right, and I'm just going to pull this up on the screen a little bit. And you can leave the tips to show on startup if you want. I'm just going to close this tip of the day screen. And we'll work with the project in another video but in here we're going to go into the SDK manager. The SDK manager is the little icon of the Android with the download or the down arrow on here. So I'm going to click this. Now you can see that by default we've got the most recent version of Android which is Marshmallow and you can note here these are all candy names or sweets names. Uh, so it's kind of an interesting little story about that that you can read in the book. But um, So here we have Marshmallow that's installed. We want to also include uh, Kit Kat and we'll do Ice Cream Sandwich. Those should be good for us to start with. Uh, we can always come back in and add additional ones if we find the need to, but these are good ones to start with. So from here I'm going to click OK. We have to confirm that we're going to make these updates, and so we'll click OK. And it'll go through the process of downloading and installing each of the components that we selected. So I'm going to pause this while it goes through the installation. Okay, so all of our packages were installed, and then I'm just going to click Finish. Okay, once we've installed those, then we have the first application in here actually looks pretty cool based on we didn't do anything other than give it a few names and go through the opening set of wizard questions. So that's it for this video. Our objective was to go in and add the SDK packages, which we've done and we'll have another video that goes into more detail of building our first application and doing an overview of the screen and making a few changes in an app.